It's a penguin on the beach. No, he's not a penguin. He's a blue jay. I'm sorry. <laughs> Before we get into today's video, don't forget to check out this special Halloween edition where we make a mutant candy bar over on the Proper Life channel. There will be a link in the description down below for you guys to check it out. See you there! Hey what is up you guys, it's Megan and today is a very very exciting day because we are going to be playing Animal Crossing Pocket Camp which was just announced by a Nintendo, I think it was yesterday or the day before, I think it was the day before. Um, the game is not yet live in America, it is live in Australia so I have made an Australian iTunes account in order to play this game kind of early for you guys because it launches worldwide um, in November. If you've not played Animal Crossing before and you like my channel, I think that you will like Animal Crossing. It's very cute, it's very fun, so I hope that you guys give it a chance. I've been playing Animal Crossing since I was a small girl, probably like in the second grade, like 2002 or whenever the very first one came out. That's when I started playing it. So I'm so excited to share this experience with you guys and I hope that the game is fun. Disclaimer, I tried to record this a little bit earlier but my air server wasn't working very well and the game was laggy so I um, am borrowing Zach's laptop to help me record the video. So this game looks really cute and I'm really excited to start. I cannot link my Nintendo account because it is an Australian account and it said I couldn't. Um, so we are going to go ahead and get into it. I already made my character but I haven't started playing yet. So here we have the very first scene of us joining the little town. Um, and hopefully it's good. I had to answer a question at the beginning um, about like what type of vacation I'd go on and I said explore the wilderness. So I don't know if that changes the camp or what, but I decided what my character was gonna look like. Here she is. She should be coming out of this camper soon. Ugh, this is her. I love her. She's so cute. Want to walk somewhere? Just tap the screen. Drag your finger across the screen. Your character will follow along. Tap anyone or anything that catches your eye. There's a lot to discover. Questions? You can always check out the beginner's guide. Oh, so cute. We're running around in circles. So there's a little campsite we have going on here. A little, little axe over here. Can I mess with this? Can I touch this? I should probably just talk to Isabel first because she's pretty, um, pretty good. Let's talk to her. Ah, oh, welcome. You must be the new camp manager I've been waiting for. It's great to meet you. I'm the what? Or are you sure? I said I'm the what? No need to be modest. I've heard great things about you. Now, I have you all registered and everything, but I'm not quite sure how to pronounce your name. Up to 10 characters. Well, luckily my name is only five. It's Megan. Did I hear that right? Do you go by Megan? That's me. All right. Welcome to your new campsite, Megan. Thank you. My name is Isabel, and it's, a, it's my pleasure to show you around and explain how things work. As camp manager, you've got to run this place. You can set up amenities, furniture, any way you like. There's so many possibilities. And of course, since it's such a spacious campsite, you'll be able to host quite a few guests. Good. Sounds good. Great. Now I'll just need a tiny bit more to make this place perfect for you and your guests. Oh, and a bit more information too. Tell me, how would you describe your ideal campsite in one word? Natural, cute, sporty, cool, cute. Campsite themes. Oh, cute. Fan of this one, Rosie. That's adorable. Um, can I see what the other ones look like? Let's see what natural looks like. Ooh, I like the natural one. I like the natural- <gasps> Goldie. <laughs> I like Goldie. Let me look at the other ones. But I think I'm gonna go with natural. Sporty, Jay's a fan of that one. Um, and then we have cool. Ooh, Apollo, not my style. Oh, I don't know if I wanna do cute or natural. I think we're gonna go with cute. Mm. Cause Rosie, she's a cute cat. You know, we got the cute little pink squirrel back there. I can't remember her name. Um, I want it. Got it. Oh, I can't wait to show you the place when it's all ready. Actually, now that I think about it, would you be able to help me out a teensy bit? I'd like to get you all set up with brand new furniture, but I'm a little short on craft materials. Why don't you drive the shiny new camper over to Breezy Hollow and see if anyone needs help? Trading crafting materials around is kind of how we do things here in this country. County? Country. Town. Con tree county. I'm a college student and I can't figure out which country. <laughs> eh, map. Okay, so here we have our map <gasps> and Rosie's over here. Oh my gosh, okay. Oh my gosh, I have not had one fruit from the orchard that's not 100% delicious, silly. So I guess her catchphrase is silly. Adorable. So she wants one apple. Let's go. Beep beep. Oh, we have peaches here. Okay, as you travel around, you'll meet visiting animals who could use a little help. 
give them time give them the things they need and you can level up your friendships you'll also get bells and special gifts just remember you're all camping so new friends will move around some keep an eye out we are all camping hello rosie whoa whoa hold the phone do i know you, you look kind of familiar but i don't know why huh weird right anyway my name is rosie what should i call you megan oh my gosh i always wanted a friend with that name silly it's almost as if fate stepped in to make sure we'd cross paths while braving the great outdoors. Oh, yes. Oh, we got a little friendship level. Guys, you get a friendship level with the animals. So, uh, Megan, what brings you to this neck of the woods? I know I'm here to stock up on delicious fresh fruit. Need a hand with that? No way. You want to, like, help? You are the best. If you could bring me an apple, that would be terrific. Oh, I like her. Aww. Okay, so up at the top we have our little friendship level with the animals. Um, we are gonna go get some apples. We can do like these Nook dollars, which are like microtransactions, which cost real money, which I can't do because I have an Australian account. Um, I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> so, okay, so we're gonna pick up these apples and it looks like they're gonna grow back in about two hours and 59 minutes, which is realistic to the real game. So for those of you who are not familiar with Animal Crossing, it's this really cute game where you are a person, where you are this little person or whatever person you choose to be. You talk to villagers, you do favors for them. You can fish, you can um, collect, you can plant flowers, you can mine minerals, you can dig up fossils. You can do a lot um, and you can shop create clothing. It's it's very fun, very customizable. You have a little house and you usually put things in it this um, time it's a campsite or a camper. So we have a lot to do. Look, Lil Simsy just went live on Twitch. Huh. So I cannot pick up the clovers or anything like that. We're exploring a little bit around here with the cute picnic site and stuff. We have to give Rosie this apple, but I just want you guys to like take in how cute this game is. We sit, we sit, we hang out. It's adorable. It's cute. Okay. Just trust me guys. Let's go ahead and talk to Rosie. Let's give her the apple. So, what's the status on the favor we discussed? I got it right here. Here you go. So we give Rosie a little apple. Thanks a bajillion. She's adorable. Request complete. So what do we get for completing this request? Here's your reward. A hundred bells, two cotton. All right. Um, I'm amazed, Megan. And cool, a cool name and dependable? Yeah, the whole package. This Rosie character reminds me a lot of um, my friend Victoria. <laughs> FYI, the cotton I gave you can be used to make furniture. Just talk to Cyrus and he'll guide you through the whole process. When it comes to crafts, I'm totally useless, silly. Alright, so look, we gained a little bit of love with her. Um, so do you have time to do me another favor, Megan? Because I'm seriously craving a cherry peach and an orange. Could you find them for me? Yes. So she wants um, a peach. Let's pick these up. Tap, tap, tap. And get the third one. Run over here. Let's get the cherries. Grab the, grab the cherries. <laughs> we want to collect all these because we don't want them to like block the ground or anything like that. They'll probably stay on the ground indefinitely. And an orange. I wonder if this is Rosie's tent over here. Let's see if we can explore it a little bit. Can I go in here? I can't. I cannot. I cannot go into Rosie's tent. But here, we can give her the fruits that she wants. So, what's the last on that favor we discussed? Got it right here. Here you go. We'll give it to her in a little doggy bag. That's adorable. Thanks a bajillion. You're welcome, Rosie. Please move into my campsite. This fruit looks absolutely amazing. It smells good. It looks good, which means it probably tastes good. Let's dig in, silly. Okay. Oh. I'm enjoying fresh fruit with Rosie. This is the best. Request complete. Here's my reward. 300 bells, 2 cotton, and then another bonus, 2 cotton. That should be enough to craft some of the stuff that we need, right? Okay, do we get a better friendship level? Let's see. Oh, we got, oh, we got, we got some stuff just for being our friend. We got three pieces of wood, 200 bells, and one cute essence. Thanks, Rosie. Meeting people like you is exactly why I love traveling. We need to stay friends, Megan. Um, I wonder if my campsite is ready. Right, so let's head home, back to the campsite to see what we've got going. If you got an eye out for a new piece of furniture, okay, I didn't get to read that. Oh, we got the, we got the alpacas up there. Oh, the campsite is adorable. It's all pink. Megan, welcome back. Well, I hope this has been worth the wait. Everything is almost ready. Uh, looks good. Oh, I'm glad you like it. I should point out the lovely furniture from Cyrus and Reese. 
They're over there. Should we go talk to them? Yes, we're gonna talk to them. They're the owners and operators of Retail on the Road, a mobile craft workshop unlike any other. It's nice to meet you. Oh, look at that. You've already got your hands on some craft materials. I'd love to show you what we can do with them. Show me, please. Let's do it right now. Take a look at the craft catalog and see if anything strikes your fancy. Okay, so we have a little cute couch here. We can order screen it. It looks like um, it only takes six cotton only. That's like all the cotton we have. Um, look who loves this. Rosie would love this, so let's craft it. Good eye. I'll get right on it. Thanks, Cyrus. Huh, that's Cyrus for you already. Hard at work. He often has other projects too, so it could take him a little while to get yours done. Of course, if you're feeling antsy, you can always spend things, speed things up with leaf tickets. Here, I actually have a few extra leaf tickets, uh, and I can show you how it works. Good. So, this is where the microtransactions come in, which I'm not going to be doing too many of them, at least not at first, because I, once again, am an American with an Australian iTunes account, so my payment does not work. Or, whenever I tried, it didn't work. So, it has one minute left, so let's click on this, and let's pay a leaf ticket to get it completed right now. I saw that some things can take up to, like, five days to get completed. Like, if you have a really big pool project or something like that, it can take up to five days for Cyrus to craft it. Whew, all finished. So we have this new lovely seat. Not bad if I do say so myself. Take good care of it, okay? All right, I suppose it's time we head back to town. Bye, goodbye. Be sure to let us know if you want to craft anything else, Megan. We're ready. In fact, we're just a few taps away on your phone, and we've always expanded our catalog. You should see some of the bigger amenities that Cyrus has crafted for our clients. So we gotta check that out. It should be good. Whoa! That's a really nice piece he made for you. I'm a little jealous. It's gonna look great out here, too. Here, I'll help you get it set up. Decorating space. Tap the grid icon. Beep, beep, boop, boop, bop, beep, bop, bop, boop, bop, beep, bop. Got it. I didn't read any of the tutorials, so hopefully it's not a problem. Place item. We have this little couch here. Let's place it. Oh, that's a perfect spot for it. Done. Save it. It's perfect, don't you think? Oh, I almost forgot. You've got to set up a place to sleep. Uh, here, find a good place for this basic tent. Okay. So not my camper, but instead my basic tent. It looks like we can put it over here. Place item. Now, eventually I think we're going to be able to craft our tent and make it cuter. Same with our camper. Oh my god, we have a little we have a little lunch pail over there with a sandwich and an apple in it. Let's go check this out. Come on, Isabel. There we go. Now it's all coming together nicely. The only thing left to do is start inviting more people to come enjoy the place. Come on, I know someone who would love the way you got things set up. Rosie? Rosie? Let's host animal at campsite. Come on over, Rosie. Oh, she's adorable. Wow. Wow. She's sitting on the lovely couch, you know, really comfy on her butt, on her little cat tushy. Um, what else? Oh, and she's taking a little cat nap on the hammock. So cute. I feel like I'm going to cry. Um, and there we go. It's set up. <laughs> As I expected, your campsite didn't disappoint, Megan. I wish I knew your secret. Well, Rosie, Cyrus crafts me things and you gave me all the materials. Yes, now Rosie can come visit the campsite anytime. New guest invited. Wait, so like, if they don't like it or they're like, eh, I'm never coming here again. Thank you. It's so much fun getting everyone together like this, don't you think? I just love this place. Okay, so, wait. Whoa, you're off to a great start. I knew you'd make a first class camp manager. I can't wait to see how things are going whenever you're hosting all sorts of visitors. Oh, I almost forgot. I have one more surprise for you. It's a small camper warming gift. As well as adorable. Ooh, outdoor fun starter pack. So we got three fertilizer, a jar of honey, sea throw net, river throw net, wood, cotton, and 2,000 bells. It's kind of a starter pack for the great outdoors. After all, there's so much to do around here. I hope the pack helps you experience it all. Well, I suppose I should get going. I've got an important job to do, too. That said, I'll try to make myself available at the marketplace, so come by if you need me at any time. I want to see if I can get my camper customized, so I think we're going to also head to the market. New animals have been added to your contact list. Goldie, Jay, Apollo, and Filbert. And we can also craft some new items, too. Fire up your camper, the tour, and, and tour the rec recreation areas. 
Okay, you ready to download the game data? Wi-Fi is recommended. Okay. Oh! Boop! Boop! Look, I'm a little camper! I can jump! Are these real bells that I get? It's a fun little mini game. $95.99? Oh no! Oh no! Come on! Get to $600! Oh no! Just $590. Oh, we'll get the bell star mailbox later. Sounds fun. Ooh, login bonus. So it looks like we get bonuses for logging in each day. Tomorrow we're gonna get three wool. All right. We sent one more bonus into your mailbox. Tap and collect the mailbox item. Oh, stretch goals. Complete. Oh, Megan. What? What? Your impeccable taste is on display again at the campsite. I'm so glad you invited me over. I was just having an amazing time here when I realized that there's still room for improvement. The place needs a little more me. Not literally, of course, though I would totally love to meet myself. I'm just saying this place could be so great if you hosted all kinds of visitors. Look at this place. Was that what the natural campsite would have looked like? Kind of wish I picked natural now. What do you guys think? If I had the option to change it, should I change it to natural? Of course, I'm right, so let's get the party started. Okay, silly? I love that idea. Oh, I know it's going to be perfect. In no rush, I know it's just the place for you to get started. You should really get over to Saltwater Shores ASAP. Not only is it a fabulous waterfront park, it's a good spot to meet up with some new animals. Maybe you'll meet someone who can help you out in exchange for some crafting materials. Thank you. I don't want to go there right now. I want to go to the marketplace. It's not letting me. We got to go get Jay a fish. So here we are on the beachfront. There's a fish. Tap to cast your line. Oh no. Okay. Boop. Now we wait. We wait for this thing to catch a line and want to... Oh, okay. Where... Oh, tap. Whew, we got it. What is it? It's a horse mackerel. Yes. Awesome. So let's go see if we can find Jay, because he's kind of wanting one of these. He's a penguin on the beach. No, he's not a penguin. He's a blue jay. I'm sorry. <laughs> High five. We're road bros now, brosephine. Ooh. So what's up? Um, Here, take this. Here you go. Whoa, you're giving this to me? That's amazing. Request completed. All right, so we got three preserves and 100 bells. Thank you, to uh, thanks a bunch. You totally made my day, Brosephine. You're welcome, Jay. Okay, so now I think we can go anywhere. I want to go to the campsite. Let's go see if we can customize our camper. Ooh, the one with the lace is really cute. So this is my camper. It's kind of boring. And here we have a bunch of penguin looking birds. Or are they pigeons? I can't tell. Hey, pal, welcome to OK Motors. Giovanni says. Name's Giovanni. Um, the name's Giovanni. Or Giovanni. And you must be Megan, right? Isabel told me about you. Anyway, I see that you're already the owner of a fine automobile, but you ain't seen nothing yet. Me and the boys here can help you customize that thing into a chariot worthy of a queen. So let's get started. Sounds great. Beautiful. Now here at OK Motors, we specialize in campers. We can make your camper bigger. We can make your camper beautiful. We can make your camper shine. Now, let me introduce you to the boys. First up is old Carlo. Body man and mechanic extraordinaire. Say a few words, Carlo. Yo. Oh, I thought he said yo. You can count on me, kid. Here, he don't say much, but he's doing this a long time. He's used to working with my pops. And over here, we have... Bebe, Bebe, our painting prodigy. Hey, I'll paint anything. I'll paint your shirt, your shoes, your hat, whatever. Oh, I'll even paint your camper. That's what I want. Bebe is very good with paint. Now, I've been thinking, you've already got your own camper, but I can't let a new customer walk out of here empty handed, so I gotta make you a deal. I want time only special, we will customize your camper for free. That's right, I said free. All you gotta do is pick the colors and so on. What do you wait for? Oh, yeah, boy. Okay, so we want, do we want stripes? Do we want vertical stripes? Do we want two-tone wave? Racing stripes? I kind of like the look of this one. So, I like the pink color a lot. And then for the secondary color, I'm thinking yellow. Blue would be cute too, or purple. Ooh, the lilac is nice. Oh, there's so many options. I think we're going to go with the yellow. Let's do it. You got it. Leave the rest to us. Pepe, Carlo. 
Let's get it painted. <laughs> Cute. Okay, motors. Woo! I haven't been this sweaty and greasy since yesterday. Make way, boys. I'm hitting the shower. Uh, don't take it out on the shower, boss. Any reason you're all dirty? You two work this out. I'll be in the bath for the next six hours. Oh, so they got really dirty painting our camper. It's so cute! Thank you. Now that is sharp. Great choice, kid. So, that's about it for now. I hope you're happy with the free custom job. Come on back anytime, okay? Okay, thank you. What are these? What are these about? Hey, buddy. Man, you want to talk about classy? Your vintage camper's looking so classy with that paint job. If you ever want to go with one of my special designs, talk to Giovanni, okay? Okay. How's it going, pal? How can we be of service? Uh, expand it. Customize my camper. New p change camper style special paint job. How much do they cost? That's what I want to know. New paint jobs. Oh, they're pretty expensive. Uh, not right now. <laughs> Well, guys, I think that's a really great place to end today's episode. So if you guys enjoyed it, don't forget to hit the like button, the subscribe button, and leave a comment down below of what you want to see in the next Animal Crossing. I hope that you guys enjoyed this, and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye!